So I've been doing YouTube for four and a half years. And admittedly, that's not as long as some of the other creators on the platform. I've definitely had my fair share of changes in the way I make and create content for the website. So when I first started YouTube, I adopted this kind of mentality that I had to post three videos a day. Doesn't matter what happens, rain, shine, hail, three videos a day. Didn't upload three videos a day, bad day, I felt bad. Now obviously, times have changed. And for sure the videos back then, they required very minimal editing, if any at all. It was cut, clip, render, slam that on the internet, rinse and repeat three times a day, call it a day, sometimes. I remember there was one day I did like 20 Minecraft videos in a day. Definitely not what you could call quality content. And over the last year, I think I've definitely created what I would like to perceive as quality content. Quality content. So this main channel right here, we got some questions I need to ask you guys about. Now, of course, I also do have my second channel as well, Lachlan Plays. That's where I upload all types of gaming videos, particularly the ones in which I swear. Now, the videos I upload on that channel, they're more raw. I don't take the video quality to a higher level than I do here on this channel. Of course, however, sneaky plug, do go check it out. I, I make some pretty good content over there. Although, be warned, it is mature audience only. I swear. A bit. But this channel over here, I really do take pride in the content I create and when I see a video, you know, not perform as well as the others, it kind of goes, oh, Why did this happen? No, actually, that's, it, that's the much less more dramatic um, equation. It's normally something like, WHY IS MY CHANNEL DEAD?! I'm, I'm, I'm just kidding. And the disparity of views, it definitely does make sense. I obviously come from a heavily focused Minecraft background and at one point transitioned to a heavy amount of Pokemon Go. Unfortunately, Pokemon Go didn't hold up to having the depth I thought it had. It was pretty obvious when I think about it, but it just, the game had an end. It wasn't like a Minecraft or any other kind of open game. It had a definitive end and I didn't realize that and honestly, it's a massive shame I still to this day will say Pokemon Go is by far the funnest game I will play on this channel that I enjoy creating content for hands down Whatever I do, especially when I travel the Chicago Pokemon Go Fest had a little few hiccups But it was the most fun ever and then a couple weeks later. I topped that off with the Yokohama trip I'd say that'd be trip of the year. That was so much fun Especially because I got a Mewtwo and I was one of the first people in the world such a fun trip plus Japan is just but obviously Pokemon Go, you know, I can't create that content every day. If I could, I would, but eventually I will run out of Pokemon out of the Pokedex. I've got three left and it's kind of already done. And you've probably already seen what I'm trying to say here is that I'm trying to start different types of content here on the channel, whether that be Minecraft, that's right, I'm bringing Minecraft back to the channel in some way, but it doesn't seem to be receiving as well as other videos. Arc Pokemon seems to be a uh, actual favorite right now. Just a little bit of a shame that it's the most triggerable game to play yet. Seriously, you die and lose all your items. Such an unforgiving game. But what this video is about is pretty much asking you guys to give me feedback. Yes, you heard me feedback. You ever seen that scene from The Notebook where Ryan Gosling's like, what do you want? What do you want? It's not that simple. What it's do you want? Now, I don't know if I'm 100% correct here, but I remember watching this video from PewDiePie and there was something along the lines of sometimes you don't listen to your viewers. And I kind of get that because it's like, you don't know what you want. You know, that's the takeaway. You don't know what you want, but I have to try and figure out what you don't want, which makes it hard. Because if I don't know what you don't want, then I don't know what I want to make. And that's a lot of doing and wanting and not knowing what to want. All right, I'm quitting my YouTube channel. What I'm trying to say here is that when I upload a video in the next couple of days, because I'm going to be trying to do some different types of stuff in the coming weeks, I want you to heavily agree or disagree on the video and tell me whether or not this is the type of content you A, enjoy or B, you think is suitable for this channel. I don't want to limit myself to a couple of games. I want to expand and do videos on any type of game I play. The only guarantee I make to you is that it won't be the same thing every other time. But like I said, I do hold my content here on the main channel at a higher standard. I will edit it so it actually is fun and enjoyable to watch no matter what type of game you really like to enjoy obviously there's gonna be fan favorites and flavors of the month just don't get too caught up on the flavors of the month thinking they'll last forever <laughs> Pokemon go so if you made it this far into the video I want a couple things from you when you go down to the comment section of this video and type in the type of content that you will enjoy. And yeah, I guess the whole thing is just to build a discussion about what you guys want to see so that I don't waste my time 
making the content that you don't want. And this also works within the next week of content. Be very critical about what you see and hopefully we can start making some absolute bangers. And if you leave a comment about making a diss track, sorry, it's just not happening because I love everyone on the internet and I would never diss anybody. Next up, what I want you to do is to hit me up on Twitter and tweet me whatever type of stuff you have really enjoyed watching me in the past. Now for YouTube, what this normally means is I go over here, I go most popular, and I go, hmm, yes, okay, they really enjoyed my Pokemon Go Let's Play Episode 1. Let's play Pokemon Go. See, that doesn't work. That was, that, that was, that was a year ago. This is a little more fresh. Taking a first class Emirates flight. Can't do that one. I got that one for free. I can't, I don't have the money to do that again. So in conclusion, throughout the next week, I'm going to try really hard and making a lot of different content here. Maybe even potentially double uploads, a few live streams in between here and there, and just really trying to gauge your feedback on whether or not to keep creating that type of content. I really don't want to work. And like, this is the big thing. I really don't want to work off of views, but at the end of the day, the views pay the bills. So I kind of have to. And also I'll be making daily content on my second channel. That's where the Slime Rancher series has moved over over up from here. So make sure to hit that up over there. I'm making, I like to think some pretty good stuff over there for a more mature kind of audience. And yeah, let me know what your feedback down below and I will see you guys throughout the week with good stuff.